What is up guys? Left first here and today we are unboxing the newest Beyblade. I know everyone's been waiting for me to unbox because I literally see it every single time I look at my comment section. The most like comments like, hey Noah, did you know that uh, HE Double Hockey 6 Salamander released? Why don't you have it? And I'm like, boy, I don't live in Japan. I'm sorry. I can't get the days on the release date. I have to wait for the stupid EMS shipping to get them. Anyway, so yeah, uh, like I said, we're unboxing HE Double Hockey 6 Salamander today or as some people call it uh, heck lizard because no one wants to call it the H word because that's just a bad word, my dudes. That's a bad word. Heck lizard or H double hockey six salamander. Anyway, so yeah, here is the Beyblade right here. There's a bit of glare, which is um, kind of concerning because you can't really see the Beyblade too well right now. But once I take it out of the package, it'll be okay. And yeah, here's the box. It just says, uh, it just just tells you that it's B13 Takeratomi Beyblade Burst. Oh yeah, this is a left spin bait. It's pretty hype. It's pretty hype. Look at that design though. It looks so nice, guys. I'm looking for I'm just, I can't wait to like battle against all my other Chosetsu Bays and just to see uh, all my other Chosetsu Bays. But I only bring out one Beyblade. Uh, I only have one Chosetsu Bay. I'm joking. I got all the Chosetsu Beyblade, guys. Don't worry about it. Well, I might do a video on all of them in the future versus HE Double Hockey Salamander. I don't know. Anyway, so yeah, on the side, it just explains its driver gimmick and uh, just says its name. It's H E Double Hockey Stick 12 OP. It should have came with two OP because that would be hilarious. H E Double Hockey Stick uh, Salamander. He's two OP. Get it? That's hilarious. Anyway, so yeah, and on this side, it just shows the owner of this Beyblade. His name is Suwo, and he's a pretty cool character. Literally, right now in Beyblade Burst, as the time of recording this, he's a savage. He beats everyone. I don't think he lost like one battle ever since he got H E Double Hockey 6 Salamander. He's never lost one belt. He's such a savage. Anyway, so yeah, that's the front of the box. On the back of the box, it just explains its parts. Again, HS for uh, Heck Lizard. Or I guess HS can't stand for Heck Lizard because Lizard starts with an L. So I guess it stands for Hockey Stick. So uh, the Hockey Stick, the 12 disc, and the OP driver, which is the OP driver. The most OP driver in the game is Operate. I think that's what it's called, right? Operate? I think it's, I think OP stands for operate. Anyway, whoa, what? Is this a misprint? It literally says, uh, H E double hockey six Salamander's full name, 12's first name, full name, but when it goes to operate, it just says OP. That's just how OP this driver is. They didn't even call it its actual name on the box. It's just, it's just, oh, it's just OP. It's just OP. Anyway, so yeah, uh, explains its little gimmick where it can mode change. And yeah, here are the stats and here's, uh, recommended combo stats. Or no, no, no. Here are the stats stats for its defense mode and here are the stats for its attack mode so yeah let's just get into unboxing this thing or unpackaging this thing since i guess it's not really a box kind of weird how we call unboxing but like don't worry about it <laughs> so yeah i already took off all the tape so it's just easier to take out look look how nice it is kabam wabam kaboom that was lame. Anyway, so yeah, here is the Beyblade. So look how awesome that is. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention this is a booster which means it doesn't come with a launcher, which is like, why do you even need a launcher for uh, these Chosetsu Bays? Because when they do come with a launcher, they usually come with a dinky proto launcher, which really sucks. Anyway, so yeah, here are the Beyblade, here's the Beyblade up close. I'm gonna unbox it right now. Ah, strength, I'm so strong. This reminds me of the Hasbro packaging. I know everyone says that, but it really does. It's like, literally Takeru Tomi's taking notes from Hasbro. Hasbro should take notes from Takeru Tomi. Anyway, so yeah, let's look at the parts individually. Oh my gosh, dude. This thing is big! This thing is so big! It looks bigger in person than it does on camera. Here, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go, well, I guess I won't be right back because I'm, I'm still gonna be there, but I'm gonna get Maximum Garuda, or this is uh, Maximus Garuda according to the Hasbro name. And look at this, let's compare sizes. It's almost as big as Maximum Garuda. It's almost as big as the banana, that's crazy. I need to weigh this thing later. Anyway. Uh, let's go more in depth on it. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I oh wait, where's the box? I think it looks like a lot better with stickers the pictures I've seen with stickers. It looks a lot better. Oh, yeah here here I'm gonna hide my QR code, but here it is with stickers with the blue highlights Like I think that just looks a lot better with stickers So I'm gonna have to put stickers on after this video and I'm not gonna put it on this video because that takes too much work So yeah, here it is and it looks so nice. It's so circular. It like gives me kind of that wyvern kind of vibe It's nice. It's nice and it has so much metal. It has like so, it has a bunch of metal claws on the outside. It's so heavy. It's so big again. And look at that thing. It looks so nice, guys. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I, I want to say that this is my favorite Chozibe, but like, 
I, I feel like after like a month, I'll probably not like it as much anymore. So let's give it time. Anyway, and it doesn't replace Spriggan. Spriggan's is irreplaceable. Spriggan's like the best Beyblade. You're cool, Salamander. And you guys both start with S. And you guys are basically the same color scheme. And you guys are both balanced types. But I still like Spriggan not more. Anyway, so yeah, here's the design. And again, it looks really nice. And I think this Beyblade, if it has decent teeth, it's probably going to be really good for defense. Just, just because how round it is. And uh, yeah, let's look at the teeth. Let's see if the teeth hold up and what i they're non-existent i literally where where were the teeth where are the teeth no i mean i'm, I'm looking at them in person they're not really non-existent they're not like uh they're not guardian curvius teeth and they're definitely not banana teeth but they're like not they're not that good they're not that good i guess balance types aren't known for having the best teeth but they uh, well balance types they can either have really good teeth or they have really bad teeth usually they have bad teeth though which is which is kind of an oof anyway so the mode change for this Beyblade, i think it's like twin nemesis where you just pull this thing down oh there we go and then you just gotta turn it like, oh, there we go. This, did you hear that? There's like a satisfying snap right here. Like, guys, look at this. Nice. Anyway, so yeah, this is the attack mode. It's basically where the spikes are connected to uh, the, or the metal spikes are connected to the plastic, which gives it more attack power. Even though it goes left spin, that's kind of weird since it says attack mode, but it goes left spin and it's literally no sharp corners. And uh, yeah, that's basically the layer. Let's move on to the disc now. This is the 12 disc that comes with it. Now this disc uh, already came out with Winning Valkyrie and it sucks and it breaks Beyblades. Takira Tomi, stop releasing this. And finally, we're down to the new part. Another new part, this is a new part, but uh, the new uh, driver, and this driver is called Operate, also known as OP. Now, the videos I've seen, OP is not that OP. It's kind of ironic. OP is not OP at all. It's not overpowered. It kind of sucks. Anyway, so basically, the gimmick for this driver is that uh, right now, it's just a wide ball driver. And it's not free spinning. Uh, people thought it might be free spinning because it looked kind of free spinning, but it's not free spinning. It's just a... Uh, uh, it's just not free spinning, it's just, a, it's just a ball driver. Anyway, so uh, the gimmick is it, you can change from attack to defense mode. And right now it's on defense mode, as you can see, it says defense. And the way you can change it is you just gotta pull it up, I think. Or yeah, you pull it up. I, I don't know. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. The way you change it, sorry, my bad. You just push it over to attack mode and then you push it down. And there, it's attack mode, which makes the ball a bit more, like, revealed. And it makes it kind of unbalanced. Like, look at that, look at that. And it'll make it jump around. It's awesome. Anyway, so yeah, that's the Beyblade, uh, all the parts. And let's put the parts together. And, ah, uh, I don't know, guys. For a uh, defense type, or not not a defense type, but for a left spin Beyblade, these teeth are these teeth are bad. But like I would have liked better teeth. Like they're no Ark Bahamut teeth. Like Ark Bahamut has like the worst teeth ever. These teeth, they're not bad teeth. Anyway, so yeah, here's the Beyblade all put together, and it looks pretty nice. I, I think for most battles, I'm gonna use attack mode just because attack mode is more fun. And uh, yeah, let's do some test battles right now. I have all my Chozy days right here. I just need to get the launchers because I wasn't prepared. So yeah, give me a second. Okay, so I got the launchers. Let's test test it against all the other Chozy Bays, and I'm sorry if I sound kind of tired in this video, it's because I just came back from school, like literally I got back from school, and I got this Beyblade, I was like, okay, I gotta unbox this right now, because it looks so cool, but I was like, I'm so tired, because it's like the last week or, s week or two of school, and you know how like, uh, the teachers in school are like, okay, it's the last two weeks, and we don't know what to do, so uh, I'm just gonna give you projects, so I have like a project in every single one of my classes, and it sucks. Anyway, enough ranting about school. Let's get into the battles. Let's do uh, HE Double Hockey Six Salamander. First, we're gonna do defense mode, and uh, let's verse it against the main character. I guess. See how it does. They're both. They're both. Uh, what should I call it? They're both balance types. So yeah, let's see. Oh, I, I forgot that this is less than. Okay, let's see. Three, two, one, go. Two. There we go. Three, two, one, two, three. There we go. And I'm gonna move the legs a bit forward just so better. Oh no! You lost the Aiga! He's not even that good! Okay, may maybe that was just a fluke. Maybe that was just a fluke. HD Double Hockey Six Salamander. Come on, you can't do this. Hey, at least he didn't burst. I'll give him that. At least you didn't burst. <laughs> let's let's try it again. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. There we go. Is that attack mode? It looked kind of like attack mode. It was jumping a bit, but like, I don't know. Okay. Okay, solid hits, solid hits, solid hits. Dude, see, defense is just so boring on him, but he's doing well for the- 
Uh, first weak teeth. Oh, no! I jinxed it! I literally said first weak teeth. He was doing well, and then he bursted. Wow. Nice, nice one, Noah. Nice one. Anyway. So, yeah. Ah, uh, I don't... I don't think it's that good. It doesn't seem that good. Let's test it against another Beyblade. Let's go winning Valkyrie next. Three... I keep forgetting it's left spin. 3, 2, 1, 2. It just doesn't look like a left spin kind of Beyblade. It's not too good. But like in the anime it kind of does, because left spins are all dragons, and in the anime, AT Double Hawk is like Salamander's a dragon for some reason, even though he's not. Oh, see, it's no! No, okay, maybe, maybe it's maybe it's a weak launch thing. Maybe because it's left spin. I know some Beyblades are better left spin with weak launch. Like I know Ark Bahamut's better with weak launch. I know Lost Longness is better with weak launch. I know uh, Drain Thatcher is better with weak launch. So maybe like this guy will be better with weak, weak launch. Let's try it. Three, two, one, two. There you go. There's a weak launch. Three, two, one, go. Go. Yeah, see, dude, it's it, it. Maybe the weak launch is the way to go. Maybe the weak launch is the way to go. I'm just gonna watch the second. See if it can win twice. That'd be that'd be hype. But honestly, I just noticed this guy has like extreme balance. Like, look at this. Most Trezidis, they're like really unbalanced. Like, uh, Emperor Fornius is really unbalanced, and uh, Z Achilles is really unbalanced. But this guy, he's pretty balanced. And he beat up twice in a row! Okay, guys, if when you get HE Double Hawk Six Salamander and you put on defense mode, weak launch is the way to go. Anyway, so I'm gonna switch it to attack mode just to see how uh, it performs. And yeah, how many modes does this thing have? How many different modes can you make with this? Because you can do attack on... Or defense on defense. Oh, no, I was already on attack mode. So that, so that mode right there was defense... Uh, or attack defense and I guess you could go defense layer and attack driver I'm just confusing you and I'm confusing myself too. So don't worry about it I'm gonna change it to attack mode right now and this uh what Whatchamacallit this uh The driver really reminds me of Capricorn back in the day if you guys don't know metal fusion There was this baby called Capricorn and it used to jump around like crazy I've seen videos on this driver Let's see if it can do the same things that Capricorn does because Capricorn was such a fun driver back in the day It literally jumped everywhere and in the anime it was owned by this guy with this awesome afro And he was like he used to he is a sniper He like sniped all the babies because the baby jumped and it was like sniping all the babies. It was so cool but in real life, <coughs> sorry guys, I'm a little sick. But in, in real life, I remember my brother, he got a Capricorn Beyblade, and he was so disappointed because the Hasbro Stadiums, when you watch the Capricorn Beyblade, it literally has no way of winning. Because the way uh, it won in the Takara Tomy Stadiums was it got it out into the pockets or whatever, but in the Hasbro Stadiums back in middle fight, they didn't have, well, they had pockets, but the pockets weren't really that useful because no Beyblade would ever jump into them. Like, it was extremely hard for a Beyblade to get knocked in the pockets. Anyway, why am I railing on this? Uh, attack mode right now. And everyone knows when uh, you change HE Double Hockey 6 mode to attack mode, it's automatically Hex Lizard. So now this is Hex Lizard. It's Hex Lizard, guys. It's Hex Lizard now, guys. Also, I didn't come with the Hex Lizard meme. I think a uh, club came up with that, so uh, shout out to him. Anyway, so yeah, let's do it against Blaze Ragnarok. 3, 2, 1, 2. There's Blaze, and now let's see how Hex Lizard does. 3, 2, 1, 2. Look at, oh my god, yeah, No! You're supposed to win! But that was crazy, dude. Okay, I'm gonna do a test launch with that real quick. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do a test launch. Three, two, one, go. Dude, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I mean, it's nowhere as near as crazy as Capricorn back in Metal Fight because uh, this guy he has a ball tip and Capricorn had like kind of a quake tip, which quake already jumps. So if this guy, if this was a quake tip, that would be crazy. Anyway, let's resume the battle. Three, two, three, three, two, one, go. Oh my gosh, look at this, look at that thing! No, no, he burst in blaze! Dude, this guy's OP. Dude, this guy's, oh, 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 this guy's O, O, P, O, P. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't even mean to make that joke. It, it was just too perfect, it was too perfect. Anyway, I just noticed, it comes with the OP driver, which jumps around, and the 12 disc, and the 12 disc is known for like shredding and killing Beyblades. And mixed with the operate driver, dude, all the Beyblades are over, all the Beyblades are getting shredded on. He just jumps, and the, the 12 driver just like wrecks through all the Beyblades. Anyway, um... What battle should we do next? Let's do last battle against Emperor Fornius. Let's try that. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Go, go, go. Jump on him, jump on him, jump on him. Or, or Emperor Fornius can just jump out of the stadium. Bum bum. That was bad. Anyway, let's try that again. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. 
three, two, one, go. Take two. And if you guys wonder why- Oh! Oh, that was such a hard hit! Oh my god! Come on, attack him again! Attack him again! Attack him! Attack him! Come on! Come on! You can beat him! You can beat the Emperor! Or, or, or you can lose. That's also an option. Anyway, if you guys are wondering why I tilt launch or rush launch Emperor Fornius, is because if I don't, it's gonna go around the scene because of how bounced it is, it's just gonna jump out. So like to avoid that, I tilt launch it. Let's do one more battle between these two. <coughs> Ow. Three, two, one, two. I'm dying here, guys. I'm dying. Three, two, one. Or, or, yeah, you can jump out of the stadium again. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Oh my gosh, see, this is what happens. Maybe, okay, I'm gonna try a straight launch, guys. I'm gonna try a straight launch. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, that was a mislaunch on the driver. Wow, th these Beyblades, they just don't want to battle right now. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, did you see that jump? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm dying, guys. I'm dying. See, this is what school does to you. It kills you. It kills you on the inside and the outside. And the winner is Emperor Fortius. Now, obviously, I don't, I don't think H E Double Hockey Six Solomon or Heck Lizard is that good competitive, but it's pretty fun to you. So yeah, if you like this video, remember to leave a like and see you guys later. Left first out.